side, we ride, we die all for this. Oh my my, I know why I can't fall for this. Oh my life, I How are you beautiful people doing? It is I, the task at hand, and I'm back at it again. And today, oh, I got a burp. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Today, we're doing it. We're checking out the new five stars that have just been at not added to the game yet but they're coming out later tonight or later tomorrow night whatever the hell listen they're out right now soy phone he's the she's the first person that we're gonna look at we're gonna look at the stats too but peep this gameplay i've seen them all i've seen them before but like i i, I gotta see them again because they're still fresh so let's get it Yo, she's fucking deadly, yo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah, I like her. Um, what's it called? You know, like, that shit looks really cool. I really like Soy Phone's, like, style. How she's part of, like, the stealth forces and shit. So, she's, like, really good at martial... Oh, shit. You're not supposed to see that. She's really good at, like, martial arts and stuff like that. Let me come right to the stats. Jesus. Let's read, you know, this little passage. You can read this in the news. It's nowhere special, you know. We all... We know where the news is. It's cool that they have, like, a new news button. So people don't skip the news because the news is mad important. Literally, if you read the news, you don't even got to watch people like me make or people like me make these videos because you could just see it for yourself. You know what I mean? So, but um, I'm pretty sure you guys, you know, probably still come for you, uh, me and my personality and shit. So I fuck with you if that's why you do it. Um, what's it called? Uh, okay, let's read this. Let's read this. All soy phones normal and strong attacks have a chance to inflict poison and her special move inflicts burn once awakened to six star she can unlock frenzy to increase her strong attack hits and debilitate her to increase the duration of the status ailments her attacks caused by two seconds she is the first technique character or the first technique attribute character to be able to unlock the boosted strong attack recharge minus 14 soul trait once awakened to six star Pretty damn cool, pretty damn cool. Now let's go ahead and look at her stats. Now, I already seen the okay, these actually are more impressive. I already seen these, you know. A thousand and seven stamina right off the bat when she gets to two hundred. Six hundred and forty five attack. That's pretty good attack for somebody who's a strong attack character. So her strong attacks must even deal even more ridiculous damage since her attack is up too. Cause remember, strong attack damage, it um it equates to uh attack and spiritual pressure so if you add both of those up obviously everybody usually runs like max spiritual pressure but having a good amount of attack is good too because attack affects all damage while spiritual pressure does uh special move damage and special or strong attacks so you know it's pretty damn good 338 defense a little bit on the lower side right uh for you know the characters that come out now right or yeah, a little a little below average not too too much focus 325 that's low um spiritual pressure 725 again this is the new high now 725 like getting into the 700s if they're that then they're top tier strong attack characters um wrong car killer pretty good and then we got soy phone attacks with joko raikoban to blah 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 to inflict, to inflict immense damage and sets them on fire she got frenzy debilitator long stride friend told me this last night long stride makes it so her you go further with your uh flash steps and of course you know she has to have that sprinter plus one part of the stealth forces along with yodoichi sama like you know they gotta be force you feel me bruiser plus 20 percent. that's normal attack damage you know that's up a little higher devastation pretty sure that's damage for your special move up by 40 percent. so you know it's pretty good that debilitator for that two second you know what i'm saying for that two second that's fuck. That's amazing. Beautiful. So uh, my little analysis, just off of this and off of the gameplay, she's gonna be a pretty cool, uh, a pretty good green to get for spiritual pressure. Um, she's, uh, you know, she's gonna be up there. She's not gonna be top two, right? She's not gonna be no full bringy or. I'm not gonna 
Yeah, she might not be a full bring Ichigo. Let me just be honest, right? Because he has that full screen. He got that Getsuga Tencho, that mini Getsuga. Like, you can't, you can't, you just can't. He got the Hollow Killer. I mean, even though the Hollow Killer, Hollow Killer doesn't really matter, but you, you, right now she's not looking like she's beating full bring. Uh, and PVP, not PVE. Obviously PVE, she looks like a really good, strong attack character because she has that boss killer move really high spiritual pressure high or high for a spiritual pressure character attack you know so pretty damn good it's looking good no nothing like holy shit this is the best but it's like this is a pretty good character uh strong attack recharge that special link i definitely want that and definitely uh that's a good addition if i actually will were to pull her because you need these these are pretty damn special let's move on to shoot, I was about to say Shunsui. To Shinji. Fucking lit. Oh, that's a full scroll. That shit looks like a destroyed. Look at those normal attacks. What range? What range? What I really like about this right here is that, first off, he sounds really dope. I watched all of Bleach in um, English. I just like how that sounds. His teleporting and share, his flash stepping. It sounds really dope. That full screen, it's just deadly, dude. Look at that. Got that fire. I really like his sword too. I like Shinji a lot as a character, but the only thing about this that's not good, I mean, you'll see it when I pull up the stats. But right now, that's looking really, really cool. I like that. That looks really dope. Um, I really like how they do things like that. That's fucking cool as shit. Shinji's strong attacks hit over a wide area and once awakened to six star he can also increase his soul trait to strong attack damage 25 percent and unlock frenzy to increase his strong attack hits making his strong attack extremely deadly he is also the first character to have the captain and hollow affiliation combination meaning that soul reaper killer ability has no effect on him uh, please note while this new shinji does not have the soul reaper affiliation he is still considered to be he's still considered as a soul reaper for the purposes of using the captain's robe accessory i see okay 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 i see what they tried to do with this guy um you know that that could be kind of good you know uh i'm thinking pvp circumstances um because since he's a mind character you know a neutral attribute so they do neutral damage to him. Imagine him paired with strong attack with, with a sad link setup slash damage taken. Since there's a lot of Soul Reaper killers, but not a shit ton of Captain killers, he could have a little bit of an advantage, you know? Because he could be taking even less damage since he's only, um, since only people with Captain or Hollow can really um, fuck with him. And right now the meta is like, Full, I mean, full bring Nichigo is a hollow killer, though. That's the only thing. And then, what? Kenpachi Blue is a, a spot a killer. Um, uh, Toshiro is a hollow killer. Okay, that can I can see how that can actually be taken down, but this seems to be pretty good. I don't. Will he become meta? I don't know. But I mean, we'll have to see. He he might though. That's the thing. What what's his? Uh, wait, hold on. Oh, they don't tell you his killer, huh? I mean, actually, yeah, you do if you scroll down. Fucking dumb. Let's look at his stats real quick. He Okay, so he has a hollow killer, so that really won't matter in that aspect. But I looked at this, I don't, and it's kind of weird because he has 1034 stamina, which is good, pretty good right now, right? For a level 200. Uh, 619 attack, which you see he's a strong attack character, but his attack is a little lower than most. Um, which is, you know, normal because they focus on spiritual pressure. 352 defense, that's that's pretty good. Um, 341 focus is pretty good. 
696 spiritual pressure see this is what i was talking about it's weird because you would think if they wanted to make him top tier which i can understand he shouldn't really be because judging on the story he he did a good amount of stuff like you know chain ichigo uh went up against aizen and stuff like that like he was strong but he wasn't like that strong you know he was a captain before so i mean yeah but I don't know. He didn't. He didn't have too too much significance throughout the entire. Uh, not no 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 wait. Let me back that up. He did have a really good significance when it came to uh, to you know the fake Karakuta town and defending that or whatever with the other Gote, uh, Gote thirteen. But um, I see how they try to make him good, but not too good. I don't know. I don't know how his uh, how he would really play out in PvP. But PVE, he's definitely gonna be a god. Um, if you don't, I mean, if you don't have <laughs> mind ukiyota <laughs> like I do, um, I like the subtle. I don't like it how it doesn't come from his mouth, cause that's pretty lit when it comes from their mouths, cause it makes it look like more of a hollow. But still, that uh, that's pretty cool how he reverses all directions and hits him with that. He got the bruiser twenty percent, which is pretty good. And he got, yo, and he got long reach. This is what I was um, seeing last night, bro. He got, I just noticed, I'm not even in full screen. Jesus Christ. Sometimes I just get in that, that mode where I'm just going and not thinking about anything else but the content. Um, long reach, it's pretty good. And you, you see how much of a reach they already have aesthetically. Like now they, like that reach is even greater because <laughs> it has long reach as an ability. That's fucking dope. Um, Havoc, that's the area effect for your special, I'm pretty sure. Frenzy, obviously. Sprinter, it's pretty good. You know, extra flash step. And that devastation. I wonder how he's going to be, man. I really wonder how he's going to be. Will he be meta? That's the, that's the question. That's the question. I'm not calling it for him, but I am calling it for this next person. <laughs> Fucking dope, man. Look at that. Fastest normal attacks in the fuck. Look at that. Look at that. Shit's crazy. Multi-directional too. Here's the thing. I already did this video, or this part of the video at least, and I gotta do it again. Um, it's fucking annoying. It, this part is funny how the part where I got the most hype um, got corrupted. Now I gotta do it again, but it's okay. Because I think Ryu, I got to see, you know, Ryuken's special and his abilities and all that again. Anyway, let's just read this. Ryuken has high speed normal attacks and once awakened to six star, he gains the soul reaper killer ability. He and he can increase the power of his normal attacks, um, making him particular, particularly, 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 par I, why can't I say, huh? Particularly, particularly more deadly. <laughs> I, again, I can't believe I, Struggle line. Anyway, whatever. Let's keep moving. He is also the first heart attribute character to be able to unlock the boosted damage taken normal or damage taken minus 20% soul trait once awakened the six star. You know, so right out the gates, the dude's fucking stupid strong. Super strong. A heart attribute with damage taken minus 20. He's automatically probably like, I'm going to just go out and say it top two or top fucking three PvP characters of all time. He does amazing damage at a distance can take a lot of damage it does think of that can dish out them an insane amount of damage or hold on let me let me read the rest actually because you you're not getting me 754 attack that is the most attack in the game right the other stats you know they're obviously a little bit below um these are a little bit below average the defense and focus but that's okay um spiritual pressure obviously is going to be on the lower side because he's a normal attack character now uh right here a bruiser plus 50 percent the most unreal thing ever unreal 50 percent that's based that that's literally what bruiser does is increases your normal attack right 
So by but it's by 50%. That's like having two 25s built in. Unreal. Unreal. Long reach, unreal. Berserker, unreal. That's for his strong attacks, but still. Long reach, his attack, his normal attacks hit even further. Unreal. One thing I would like to add that I didn't do during the recording of the video or this part. I want to see how he stacks up against Kenny because we all know Kenny is like the the most used character, the most broken character for PvP. And Kenny, you know, the, his biggest thing is flurry and poise. That mix is so dangerous because, you know, obviously he just doesn't flinch and he keeps inflicting a good amount of damage and he tanks a lot of damage. So it's like him as a direct competitor to Kenny, we'll see how this goes. I read a comment earlier that was like, this is the answer to Sajin, which I I kind of disagree because Sajin, um, I can destroy him with Koga because he has a Soul Reaper and Captain Killer. So I don't really, I mean, if it's the answer to Sajin, cool, but I've already had an answer for that myself. Maybe this is just like an, an extra thing, you know, as a direct competitor being opposed to uh, the mind attribute, but let's just see how he stacks i want to see how he stacks up against kenny because he flinches even though he can tank a lot of damage he still flinches and when you flinch obviously you're not doing damage while kenny is doing constant damage constant damage let's see if his amazing damage and really fast normal attack string can uh do more dps than kenny can since he's not flinching like you know i, I want to see how that you know goes up against each other I think it's going to be a pretty interesting fight, but if honestly, if he can win Kenny's a good amount of the time, or win over Kenny's, he's going to be the best PvP player of all time, or a PvP character to use, like straight up. So we'll just see how it has to play out, you know. So that's all I wanted to add. Like, think of that. He's a tank, a super tank, right? Because he's a neutral, people do neutral damage because he's a neutral attribute. And he's a human. No one's a human killer. The only thing that can super affect him or get the damage or, or get the extra damage on him is a mind character. And even at that, it's only a certain percent because it's just attribute disadvantage. And that's it. He's a super tank that can also hit really hard and really fast because his normal attack string, you saw it, it was super fast. I'm telling you, top three. This has to be top three character. I'm calling it right now. You know? Hype. So hype. I want him, I really do, but will I be able to get him? Probably not. I don't have a lot of orbs. I mean, it's double chance. I have 196 orbs right now as I'm making this. <laughs> I don't think I can get that much orbs by the time this shit comes out. And wh what about the uh, mid-month gacha? What if that has even better care? You know what I mean? Like, it's a struggle. It's a struggle. I want him. I really do. But like, look at my team. Or, <laughs> this is not the team, but the team with... Um, Uryu, Kenny, and um, Koga. Imagine running a super, another super tank just like that. That's also a really strong range. Crazy, cra I just can't. Unreal. <sighs> there you go. I just wanted to uh, made that again. I got hyped again. That was, you know, the thing I was thinking about was like recreating a, or redoing a clip. Like you won't get the same intensity, but I felt the same intensity because like talking about the stats nerdgasming is you know what i mean like it's so dope that's so dope i re i want this character he's really cool but if you enjoyed the video um uh, that's it for today you know when these characters come out oh yeah, yeah yeah here's a good thing about recordings fucking up i can also show you something i didn't show you before before i end this video let me show you the risk you're willing to take right let's say you don't get these people right <laughs> here's the risk you're taking right now look at the summoning pool now if you're not a if you haven't played in the past six months then you're safe because all these characters are probably new to you but people like me i have every i have only two characters that aren't in this pool right or that i have two of the characters in this pool i don't have and i have everybody else uh, obviously besides the banner characters i don't have yukio i don't have fucking nemu I said Nemo, Nanao. But I have everybody else. So bad. So if I don't get the banner characters, I'm fucking screwed. There's no way I'm going to get you fucking Yukio or Nanao. So that's the risk you're willing to take. Some of you probably have all these. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, hey, it's, the, it's dumb. It's not okay. It's fucking dumb. Wish I had further. Uh, I wish I had newer characters, but hey, fuck it. Because um, it's the lost agent, right? 
whatever so show some love with a like with this video that ryu can hype is definitely real if you fuck with me no if you really fuck with me subscribe to become part of the task force spinny man with a plenty task and remember peace love and positivity and i'm out thank you so much for watching